Uh, hello YouTube and welcome back to a Pokemon Black and White uh, Let's Play. And um, right, we're heading to Nakreen City now. As as you enter the city, you'll be greeted by your rival uh, Sharon, who's gonna show you to the Pokemon Center. Well, like you know, like you don't know what Pokemon Center is already, because we've been through two towns, maybe two, two or three towns that've already had it. And then he gives you a chest of, uh, three chest of berries, which I recommend giving to your Pokemon because I think uh, the the this one, the next gym, I think it, I think it has, I think it has some way of putting your Pokemon to sleep. So I recommend maybe giving it to a couple of your team to hold because you might want to use it and there's another quite a not important item but there's another item in this here in in this here in this town city whatever that you're going to want to get which is from not this person oh yeah right this at uh, this part you're going to get an item that boosts either grass water or fire so, which is charcoal, mystic water, and the miracle seed. Now, you're going to get the miracle seed just around the corner in Pinwheel Forest. So, even if you pick Snivy, I recommend that you choose um, one of the other two because you can get the miracle seed quite soon on anyway. So, I think there's an iron round here somewhere. I don't know. Yeah, there we go thought it was. Right, so if we head up to where the gym is now, there's not really much to do in here. Oh, you can get a soda pop from here, which I'm going to go and get because it's not a bad. It's like a lemonade, basically. Okay, maybe you can't. thought you could, but maybe not. Um, yeah, if you head this way to the gym, then your rival N is going to pop out. There he is. And he's gonna battle you. He's got a level 13 Pidov. Or Pidov, I don't even know how you say it. But it's like a pigeon. And um, he's got a level 13 Timpo, which is a uh, water type. And he's got a level 13 Timber, which is a fighting type. So. I'm just gonna. Oh, I'll just use my best attacks on it and just hope that. This battle's not too hard. They're all level 13, so it's not not like they're gonna be higher than your Pokemon. So it shouldn't really cause you too much trouble. And then, so let's just. God, this fucking... I hate quick attacks so much. It's like, oh my, why did you have to survive? Every single freaking time, and it's almost killed me as well. But I'm level 14, so I'm happy. Um, yeah, I'm switching because I'm gonna send out my starter because I don't have anything at the minute. I don't have anything good against against water types, which I, it's not much of a problem at the minute because there's not really anything that's gonna be. I'm not sure I'm going to use a water type move because even though it's not very effective, it should be more more effective than. Okay, maybe not. He lowered his defense, so. Oh, and he lowered my attack. Yay. Do you love that? I'll try tackle. Let's see how this goes. Okay, that was crap. And I'm glad I avoided that because I can't be bothered with confusion at the minute. Well, I can't be bothered with it ever, actually, but. No. Ooh, almost level 18. And then I'll switch to my other Pokemon and then. Yeah, so this battle is not hard really. I don't know what I don't I'm not really sure on what moves this this little guy's got. But it can't really be anything that's gonna be too Yeah, I hate that move. It's if I can I'm gonna use this again and then I'm gonna switch out 
to my HM slave because otherwise, because I think by it doubles what damage you did to it in the turns that you attacked it while it was building up its energy or whatever it is. So I just sacrifice this and this battle's dragging on a lot longer than I would like. I just preferred to just I might level my Pokemon up during um, in between videos because then I'll make it a bit quicker but then again I don't really need to be leveled up it's, I'm about the correct level at the minute I think but you know don't help it doesn't hurt to be over leveled although I guess it gives it more of a challenge and makes the game more interesting if you're under leveled and I'm glad that hit five times because that means I KO'd him and 230 XP I'll take that 31 attack at level 14 that is epic and then I'm not sure what happens now I think he just runs off and then needs more power right and what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna go and I think uh, let's go heal up Right, um, I was saying before I went in there, I think I'm going to go and see how far down this route I can get and there's an item up here. Just remember that. There is a hidden item. There we go, super potion. That'll come in handy. Especially because this next gym is a pain in the ass. Right, uh, I'm going to head this way. Battle this... Oh, maybe not. What the hell? Just stand in there. What's this? Rock smash. Yeah, see, it's, it's only TM now, which is a bit strange. I don't know. I don't actually know if you need it. I don't think... I've played through this game. I played through it when it first came out, but I don't actually remember. I don't really remember anything to do with this, to be honest. So this person here is going to battle you if you talk to her. And if you do talk... If you do... If you beat her, which you should do, because she's not going to be too hard. But if you when you beat her... Not, not yeah. When, not if. When you beat her, she will heal your Pokemon up every time you talk to her. Which is probably most likely going to be after this battle because this Pokemon is level 15 and got high special defense. Yeah, and I didn't really do much to it, so I think I'm going to end up getting. Yeah, he's going to he's going to be killed, which is unfortunate, but uh, never mind. Um, they go and use a crap move like that. Actually, I don't know what the hell that means. Sealed my move. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> yeah, I'm not like a pro at this game, but I know I know what most stuff does, so I know how to get through the game and I know how to If I did on that if it use a crap move again then I might don't want to do it then but Whoops. Yeah, I'm gonna switch out. Oh uh, this guy. Well this girl even. And she was this and then he couldn't didn't kill it please don't kill me right another battle that took much longer than I would have liked which is annoying but yeah I can just you can just talk to her now and then she'll heal your Pokemon look there make your Pokemon healthy and then you can just keep going back to as much as you want which is handy because the forest the Pinwheel forest is right there and as soon as you get poisoned or paralyzed, you're gonna want to come. Uh, you want you're gonna want to come straight back out and heal up, and then go straight back in because. And there's another trainer here, right? And then there's this there's this guy and there's this next guy, and then there's like a bit further down, which I'm not gonna. I don't think I'm gonna go into it this 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 video. Uh, I think I'll explore that next after I've done the gym, but first I'm gonna defeat these trainers and then I'm going to go and I hope that doesn't raise special defense. Attack on special attack, it's alright. Yeah, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna be catching one of my another Pokemon of mine. Which I'm looking forward to. Because it's a Pokemon that you know, I've never really thought about using it to be honest. And then when I got my Charizard, I needed to switch my team up a bit. And then this Pokemon just seemed like a good choice. So, 
keep Charmander out and I'll be able to two more levels then I've got myself a Charmeleon so oh back in that other city that Nacreen city you can only get on Pokemon Black you can get Cottony Cottony or something on Pokemon White you can get like this Petalil and if you get the one that is of your version and you go to a woman in Nacreen City you can trade you can trade for it so if you have if you have your version so if you can get the other you can get the other Pokemon that is on only on white by trading it with a woman in Nacreen City so if you're looking to complete your Pokedex then that is something I'd recommend let's just battle this dude here Oi. right here yeah. battle this dude get that little ball up there in the top right and then uh, let's catch my fourth Pokemon so I'm getting these Pokemon pretty quick, but the this Pokemon I'm catching is going to be really handy for the... What gym are we on? Second? Yeah, second gym. Because second gym's a normal type, so you probably just you probably guessed what I'm getting. What, what? Oh, crap. I'm just going to switch. And now he's sturdy, he's not going to be able to... He's not going to be able to save himself with sturdy now, so... Switch in and then... I'll be able to attack this out and then I'll use that woman to heal me, help heal me up and Oh I hate moves why do they always they always hit like four or five times. I hit like two or three, they hit four or five every time. So Yeah, pretty much we're gonna just Level 18, that's not bad. Not bad at all. And then... Just head up here, get this... God knows what it is. Great ball. Might come in handy, that. Right, and then just head into this grass and see if I can catch my Pokemon. Right, you know what, I'm not even going to get it now. I'm going to get it in between. I'm going to get in between videos, I'm going to get it after this part because, to be honest, I'm not actually even sure if it's even in this grass here. I think it is. Right, as I was saying, I think it's in this grass. But I'm not entirely sure. So, I'm just going to battle this dude. And after this video, I'm going to have a look. And I might as well tell you the Pokemon I'm looking for is uh, Sork. The fighting type Pokemon. There's Sork and Thor. I'm after the blue guy, Sork. Who's going to be the fourth addition to my team. So. Yeah, so. Look for. I've never actually. I've never used a. I've never really used fighting types because you can normally get. There's normally Pokemon that learn, you know, Brick Break and stuff. I'll probably be teaching Brick Break to to my Excadrill when he's like when I get the TM obviously got to use it at the minute. But yeah, I'll probably be teaching him that because it's a pretty good move. It's good. It's a good move on any Pokemon really because it it only covers um steel. It covers steel, steel, rock, and normal types, but it's like normal affected on most things, there's not really anything that it's not very effective on, apart from Ghost, of course, uh, Ghost, um, Ghost and Flying, I think that's it, but Flying, most Flying types are uh, part normal anyway, so it's going to hit them for normal effective, so it's really um, Ghost, the only thing you've got to look out for when, when using a fighting move, really, or fighting type even. And this guy had three Timpos, which is pretty annoying because I can't, wouldn't it KO him because they are. This, this is the only type I. At the minute, I only the only type I have trouble with, but I, I plan on getting a Pokemon that can tech these out. Pretty. Oh no, not pretty soon. I don't know when. I, I will be getting a Pokemon that can uh, tech these out, but at the minute, I'm not gonna be.
And I think this is going to be a fairly random part to place to end the video. But. Actually, no, I don't need to end it yet. You can find an antidote there, and there is an antidote somewhere around here. Oh, maybe I'm lying. Oh, let's just keep going. We'll get the dowser machine quite soon, so let's just battle this guy. It's nowhere near as long as my last video, so I guess we're alright. And there's, I've, I've had like maybe five wild battles I can call, and then there's the thingy that there's a. The, what's it called? The healing up and stuff that I can cut out. So, this is a, a bug. Bug poison type is a new Pokemon you want to see in a minute, I don't think. So, again, it's I take it out with fire, rock. I'm not sure what else takes this out actually. Fire, rock. I don't, I don't know, mine's gone blank. Um, it's, I think it's pat poison, so ground will probably take it out as well. And I'm going to keep battling because my Charmander is about to level up to 16, which means it's going to evolve. So, I'll be good. Please do Or I can take another one of them. I might get a critical eight, you never know. Could happen. Yeah, but it's not gonna. Actually, now I'll be able to kill it, water. Holy crap, that was close. <laughs> if he used quicker type then, I would have been annoyed. I'll get a quick click then, yeah, why? Why can't you just give me it before, when I needed it most? Yeah, level 16, Dragon Rage. Um, yeah, why not? 40 damage is pretty good for this. It, it deals a set 40 damage every time, no matter what it's used on. If you used it on level, if you were level 100 and you use it on level 1, it'd still take 40 off it. So. What? Pyro is evolving. Let's watch this cool animation. This is my second evolution of the series. First one obviously was my starter. And why the heck is lagging? And it looks really strange on this. I don't know if I don't know if that's just me, but it looks completely different to the Charmeleon I know from red, blue and yellow. Ah but anyway, I'm just gonna go heal up and then I'm gonna end the video because I um so thanks for watching. Oh, shit. I apologise about that. Got interrupted then. And again. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you in part eight, part nine. Thanks for watching.